Throughout the galaxy, a legend is told. On a distant planet, a grim fortress stood. Until a deadly force parted the heavens and descended upon the keep. Though brought to ruin, the ashes of that place hold an artifact of impossible power. A gun that can kill the past. Over time, the fortress was rebuilt, and some who hear the legend would risk everything for another shot. To claim their prize and make what was done undone, they must. Enter the Gungeon! Hey guys, what's up? Robin X is here, back with the star in the back of the start of a brand new series on my channel. Now, first off, I want to apologize for how absolutely cringy <laughs> that Binding of Isaac episode was. Oh boy. Oh boy. That <laughs> The Edge. The Edge. Anyways, Enter the Gungeon is like Binding of Isaac, a roguelike with some bullet hell elements, but Enter the Gungeon takes it way further than Binding of Isaac does. And, honestly, this game is just absolutely fantastic. First off, I want to talk about this. Look at this. Look at this title screen. You've got the fortress in, in the distance. You've got this guy on the title screen with, like, a billowing cloak. And this awesome hat holding a revolver. Oh, man. This, the, the, this title screen is so cool. But I'm going to stop gushing about the title screen and actually start talking about the game. Ugh. Uh, sorry, I got something in my throat. Anyways. So, when you start up the game, you have four characters you can choose from. You've got the Marine, you've got the Pilot, you've got the Convict, and you've got the Hunter. I'm going to be starting with the Hunter because I've always had better runs with her than any other character. I've always been able to get farther, and, and you'll see why in a moment. So... Yeah, like I said, this is a roguelike, so every single run is completely randomized, from the loot to the layouts, everything. Enemy placements, all of it. It's just all randomized. So, so the so the hunter is an interesting character. She starts off with two weapons, unlike other characters. She starts off with a crossbow and a rusty sidearm. The crossbow has infinite ammo. I mean, not infinite ammo. 100 ammo, and the and the rusty sidearm has infinite ammo. I can't tell if I just said infinite ammo twice. I don't know. Infinite ammo! I'm, I'm just... I don't know what's wrong with me. I'm, I'm just having trouble with my words. Not exactly a good sign there. And yeah. So, this is one of... This game has some... Does something that I really like it when games do this. They take a singular simple concept and just run wild with it. Like... The central theme of this game? Guns and bullets. And it just goes crazy with it. Those guys, they have swords made out of pure bullets. I don't even know how that works, but it's awesome. Oh no. None of that, please. I do not need your living grenade butt ruining my day. I, I don't know. So another, another mechanic is this. You can prop up tables and hide behind them as cover. Nice. It's a nice little addition, and it's very useful. Okay, we're just gonna reload. Something that bothers me about this game. Okay, this is what. This is why Hunter gets better runs when I play as her over other, any other character. I mean, admittedly, I've only played a little bit of the pilot, and I have played quite a bit of the marine, but I've played none of the convict. But the thing is, this little guy, Junior Two. 
this precious little doggy, he can randomly find stuff. Like, you know, health, keys, blanks, which... I demonstrate a blank, but I'm going to save that for the boss fight because they're kind of invaluable. Basically what they do is they clear the room of all projectiles. Temporarily. Uh, all projectiles, so... You, if you're getting overwhelmed, you can use a blank to just clear out everything. It's really cool. And also, the tape and the um, enemies can actually prop up um, tables and use them as cover. At least those guys can. Those are called bullet kin. Ah, dang it. Dang it, I got hit. Thank goodness I've got that uh, that health in the other room. Good grief. What is with all the enemies in this room? And of course, there's a freaking ghost. Because why wouldn't there be, right? But whatever, I ain't afraid of no ghosts. Okay, okay, you're here. You're the last one. Okay, done. I'm gonna pick this up. Because I need it! I'm gonna blow that up just so it doesn't trouble me later. Because you know I'm gonna do something stupid and accidentally set it off on like right on top of it. Because I didn't get rid of it earlier. Okay, okay. Okay, so we're just gonna reload, fire again, fire, fire. Blow everything up! No mercy! None of it! There's no mercy to be had in this game! Only guns. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Okay, so we found the boss room. Uh, let's see. Where's the shop? I'm gonna find. I'm gonna go here. This is something you do. These things, you you can use the. Basically, you can hit tab to go to the map and then click on that. Then click on one of these uh, revolver clip looking things, and it'll teleport you there. And if you go back through, it'll just take you back to where you were before. So you can easily use it to get around the map if you've already been to a certain place and you're trying to go to somewhere that's like a bit of a junction. Okay. Take you out. You're dead. You're dead. And you guys killed yourselves. Fantastic. I've got water on my face now. Also, I should just got, like, get like a straw or something. But yeah, that actually would be easier to use. Like, for my water. Ooh, thank you. Thank you, Junior 2. Alright, where's the shop? Goodness. Okay. okay. You're going down. You're going down. Ugh. Ugh. So it's really bothering me today. Which, I mean, I probably shouldn't be playing video games. Oh! Litchy trigger... Yeah, I mean, pro recording this probably isn't the best idea when I'm not feeling all the well. Speaking of, I'd like to apologize for the complete lack of a uh, of an I of an Isaac episode on on the week after my previous one. I don't know when I'm going to record be, re be uploading this rather. Hopefully soon. But I'd like to apologize. I was not feeling well. A shine to I in the Icosa Hedrax, the Great Arbiter. Of course. When I don't have a key. Okay. Let's find the shop, because the shop will probably have a key for us. Is it still there? Yes, it is. Okay, that's that's not where the shop is. It, it will auto... And something I like is it will automatically show you which, you know, which is, um... Where the map is if you're a room away from it. I mean, not the map, the, the shop. I can't talk today! I'm in one of those moods. Or modes. I'm only proving my point further. Okay, so it seems that everything that I desire in this world is through here. Right. So we're just gonna go down here. There's not a uh, there's, there's not a teleport pad here, which is kind of a shame. But eh. but ah yeah, here we go. There's the shop. That that's what I wanted to see. Now see, here's my thing. Would rate of fire affect the crossbow? It wouldn't, would it? Actually, no, it does seem to affect it a little bit. Because before there was like a slight delay in when, in when the... between when, uh... 
when you reloaded and went with the gun fired, it's the, yeah, the, the heart piece is still there. All right, we're going to go through here. Oh, you're still alive. Yes, I am. Is there a problem with that? I don't know. Some gun jurors can, can catch a bolt and fire them back at you, time your shots well. I've never seen that. That's actually good to know. Okay, so it's here. I'm gonna go through here. And I'll and I'll probably head back to the shop and see if I can afford a uh is this gonna let me do it again? No. Oh, oh. Uh whoa. Jolter. Point ninety five caliber. I have no idea how good this gun is, but it looks powerful, so I'm going to try it. Hey, what have you got for me, good sir? Uh, lodestone amulet, uh, copper amulet, and a blank. I'll take the blank. Actually, wait, was this cheaper? No, it wasn't. Okay, good. For a second, I thought I'd been robbed. So, something to note. If you manage to kill a boss without getting hit, you get a permanent health upgrade for that run. Of course, that's not going to happen because it's the freaking Trigger Twins! Y'all gotta go. Alright, you know what? Bring it. Okay. So the Trigger Twins. Ah, crap! I got hit so much for that. Uh, I don't like these guys. I don't like them at all. Let's get rid of their minions, because holy cow, why does that exist? Okay, so the Trigger Twins, they're interesting. Because if you kill one, the other will get enraged. So what you want to do is you want to make sure that their health is as low as possible at all times. So try to keep them in equal health so that when you kill one, you can quickly kill the other. Okay, uh, yeah, see? Did seem to recover some health, though. Oh, I'm out of ammo for that weapon. Crap. Ay, ay, ay. There we go. Okay. Man, I really wanted to get a health upgrade this uh, this floor. Oh, my really. Uh, demon head. Eck freaking excuse me. Are, are y y you serious, right? You're serious? You're actually serious about this? Holy cow, that is amazing. Why didn't I reload my other thing? I'm an idiot. What? Why does my crossbow only have 50 ammo now? What the heck happened there? Eh, whatever. I'm not going to question it. I didn't use the crossbow much anyway, so... Alright, so if they're here... Oh, we find the shop immediately. Okay, that's fine. Uh, let's see. Got a blank for 24. Map for 42. Oh yeah, something to note. You get two... You get... No matter how many blanks you have, if you have less than two, you're always going to have two at the start of a floor. Okay, so... I need 30 of those to get a key. So I'm going to... I'm going to see if I can get a key. I'm going to explore the entire floor before I make any major decisions. Yeah, it definitely does seem to fire faster. There we go, he's dead. And so is he, and yet he's shooting at me. Game, why you gotta be so rude? And I'm missing, like, every shot. Okay, fair enough. That doesn't matter, because we're getting close to... We're getting close to the 30 coins we need in order to... Alright, you're dead. Oh boy, these things. I hate these things. Good thing he's dead. Okay, speaking of things I hate... Will you die already? Goodness! I cannot hit things to save my life today, apparently. And I'm only continuing to prove my point. Okay, I'm going to refill my Jolter. What I'm going to do is I'm going to save all of my main gun, all of my limited ammo guns for the uh, for the boss fight, and rely on my rust on my trusty rusty sidearm. 
Because, I mean, this thing's actually pretty good. It's it's not the best, but it has infinite in, infinite ammo, so... You know? I have never... Yeah, I've, I've never seen a Gunjur reflect my bullets at me. That is kind of terrifying that they can do that. Okay. Okay, you're dead. Okay, oh, oh. Crap! Ah! Uh, why am I in the same room as a... Why is that even remotely acceptable? And that, that is my big question for the day. Deaths, please. Spare us from the pain of your ghostly creations. They're not good enemies. Oh, we're doing this now. I don't know how, how I act. I must have accidentally hit the mouse wheel without knowing. Okay. I am down by two hit points, which is not even remotely good. Oh, crap. Iron Maiden. Okay. Or Lead Maiden, I think? I don't know. Knowing this game is probably a Lead Maiden. Not doing... Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Whoa there. I need that. Okay. I'm gonna hide here. You know what? You, sir, need to be exterminated. Oh, a blank. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Good boy. Good boy. I mean, you didn't find me health, but... Okay, so the boss fight is there. So I'm just going to head back to the shop and just grab some health. And I need 30 of those for, for armor. Here we go. I have three blanks. I have two blanks. How much does this cost? 24. Okay. We're gonna go here. And we are going to use the demon head, because this thing looks pretty... Oh! <laughs> Accursed Gun Witch. The Gore Gun. I can't attack. I can, I can dodge that. Okay, okay, okay. Let's switch. I got hit! No, no. Ah, so close. Okay. Okay. I mean, on the upside. Got this! With an abysmal reload time. <laughs> oh well. Let's uh let's pick up some armor. I'm gonna need it. I was so close! What a shame. Oh well. 
I mean, a, a help. I mean, I did get a bunch of armor, so that's good at least. But I get the feeling uh, this is the farthest I've ever gotten. Oh wow, this thing's a powerhouse. Holy cow, okay, yeah, I'm saving that for the boss. Okay, these little guys don't like. You. Cease your existence. Thank you very much. Okay, and then the other. Okay, okay. Hello, hello. Goodbye, goodbye. Okay, come on. No, 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 no. Okay, so he's gonna do that. Might as well grab this. I mean, all the all the blanks that you that you get in a. Uh, in a room, go and I go immediately to you once you clear it, but you know. Whatever. Okay, so there's a chest in there. Oh. Crap! That was the thing that I did not mean to do. That is also the. Th Thing I did not mean to do! No, 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 come. Go back! No! I give up. I give up. I, I'm. I'll. That's that's how you get one of the things you need to get the bullet that can kill the pass, which is how you reach the uh, the true final boss of a given character. Uh, I'll do that on my own time. Oh boy, that's just now I've lost all my armor. And oh, y y y y y why does this room exist? You are not allowed to exist. You're going to die, and I'm going to beat it once. The worst part is, I threw the run by doing that. I completely threw the run. I'm not happy. Can you tell? You! Stop existing! Right this instant! You are not allowed to exi- Okay. Okay. We've got a chance. Uh, so I have to no-hit this boss in order to- in order to kill it, huh? Is that how we're going- we're gonna do this? I love how it just sends them flying. Okay. Uh, thank you. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna... Alright. You know, I'm gonna go ahead and do this. I die hard. Oh, crap, this guy. This guy's a toughie. Execution tank. The Dreadnought. Good thing I've got, like, crazy good range. Crap, I got hit! I just want a health upgrade for crying out loud! Okay, okay. Okay, what have I got? What have I got? Hide behind here. He's going to do that. Okay, 
Okay, two shots left. And I'm dead. Well, I got pretty far. I went up a minute episode. Eh, not too bad, actually. So, you know what? I'm going to end this off here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, leave a like and tell me what you want me to do next with this game. Do you want me to do a convict run, a marine run? Do you have a certain challenge for me? What is it? Let me know. And if you want to see more from me, hit that subscribe button. I try to upload weekly. It, it doesn't always work out, but hey, I'm working on it. And as always, guys, stay sensational. See you next time. Bye-bye.